Look at all of the candy. There's so much candy. And there's two buckets, just like this, in my room. <laughs> going to be a chore day after work but after taking forever to go grocery shopping and then to go through McDonald's I ended up coming home and crashing and I slept for like three hours I'm still recovering from my what I call Disney hangover um, from yesterday I like my legs and my feet are so sore from walking all over the park. I think I walked like about six miles yesterday <laughs> and so I'm like exhausted like my feet are still killing me after work and I had a short shift today but um, I wanted to show you some things that I got yesterday that I wasn't able to share because I dropped them off with Stephanie. I've got I Put a Spell on You Stuck in My Head from the Hocus Pocus show, which if you haven't seen my vlog yet for Mickey's Not So Scary, oh my gosh, you need to see it. I didn't put the entire show in it, but I did put highlights in it because it was amazing. Like, I, I didn't want to put too much of the show in it because I didn't want to spoil it for everyone else. Um, but I also didn't want to, like, put the whole thing in it because it would make the vlog really, really long because it is a long show. But anyway, I want to show you some things that I got. I guess kind of like my Halloween Disney haul. So I already showed you my magic band um, and my card, which is in there. But um, I really love the Headless Horseman. I love the whole Sleepy Hollow thing. Um, I wish you could buy the short on iTunes. Like just the short, you have to buy like the whole pack thing. It's really annoying. But um, I love. I thought that this was really cool that it has the Headless Horseman on it. Love it. Anyway, so for Dapper Day. I'm Disney bounding as Jack Skellington because Dapper Day this year is in October. Or at least the fall, so fall soiree, I should say. And they had this really cool bucket. They had it last year. They sold out. I wasn't able to get it last year. But um, I decided to get it this year. It's a popcorn bucket. Opens here. It's really cheap up here. Um, but for $13, it's actually not that bad because it says, it says zero on it, like zero's little grave. There's this cool little handle. Zero actually glows in the dark. And then his nose has a tiny little... Isn't that cute? I wish it didn't blink, but it's perfect. I love it so much. It's gonna be really cute. I'm gonna use it as my purse for Dapper Day. Cause I'm gonna be dressed up as Jack and this will be my zero. When I went to get my zero bucket, I saw this. And one of my favorite Halloween shorts is The Lonesome Ghosts, because it reminds me of Ghostbusters, which is one of my favorite Halloween movies. And they have a cup, or a souvenir mug, I should say, that has The Lonesome Ghosts and Mickey and Goofy and Donald on it. And it's got this really cool, the lid is really neat, you can't really tell. It's like a light teal, but it has this opalescent glow to it. It doesn't glow in the dark or anything. But like, it looks really shiny and chic. Chic? Sheer? I don't know what word I'm looking for. Um, it's got a metallic kind of spin to it. Like I said, you can't really tell. But like, it's really, really cool and I'm really happy with it. I love these souvenir mugs. Those are only five bucks and you can put like water or anything in it. And I love them. I have two Christmas ones that I've used for like, since my first program, so. I'm gonna let you guys go. And, um, oh, I wanted to say one more quick thing, um, not to leave it on a sad note, but, um, I'm a huge, some of you know, I've mentioned Markiplier several times in my videos before. He is, if you don't know who he is, he plays, um, video games and he, um, uploads them online from commentary and he's really funny, really nice, sweet guy. Emily and I have been fans of him for about two and a half, or a year now, or a year and a half now, and, um, he's a really great guy, 
and uh, he has some guys that he recently added on to his team um, to uh, edit his videos for him because he's gotten you know, a lot of footage and it's really hard to upload or edit hours of footage. Well, one of the guys from the team, uh, they're Synd they call themselves the Syndigo guys, um, they, one of them passed and um, it's been really sudden and um, it's been really, really sad. Um, Mark is one of those guys that like, he, he has a lot of feelings and um, that's good in guys cause you don't always see that. And so um, I can imagine how hard it must be for Mark um, and I can not like to lose a friend and I can't imagine what it must be like for his family. Um, I haven't, well actually no I have, I've lost um, people in my life very suddenly before and it's very very sad, it takes a while to get over that and um, I know I've had issues um, this year in uh, trying to go through things in my life and uploading videos and so, but like there was nowhere near anything like this so I can only imagine how um, hard it's going to be for Mark to bounce back from this and so I just wanted to um, let all of you know who are watching this video just to kind of keep the um, the Syndigo guys and Markiplier um, and the family of Daniel. Daniel's the, the guy who um, who passed and I just kind of keep him in your prayers and in your thoughts and um, yeah and also just to throw out one last thing um, there's always an alternative to suicide. There is. There's always some, there is someone out there who loves you and cares for you. There is. And um, no one should ever take their own life. Your life is way too precious. Um, way, way, way too precious to uh, to destroy like that. And um, I just want to send you some positive encouragement and um, be thinking of them. And to have a great night. And thank you for watching.